Hello everyone. How are you all? Hope you all are fine and doing well. Also, you must be studying with the help of study material sent to you. Today, we are going to revise science chapter 1, living and non-living. I hope you all have seen the YouTube link of chapter 1 which was there with the notes. Once we revise the complete chapter, you would be able to understand living and non-living things. natural and man made things features of living things let's start we can see different things around us like we see animals plants furniture pencil etc all the things that we see around us can be grouped as living things and non living things living things are the ones that have life in them for example bird non living things do not have life in them for example table non living things are further classified into natural things and man made things natural things are the things that are found in nature and not made by men for example sun man made things are the things that are made by men for example computer there are certain features of living things that make them different from non living things Let us study these features. Living things move. Living things move from one place to another. For example, cats, human beings can walk. Plants move differently. For example, the leaves of mimosa plant closes when touched. Next feature is living things breathe. Fish breathe through gills. Next feature is living things grow. All living things grow. A baby grows into an adult. A seed grows into a plant. Next feature is living things need food and water. food provide energy to living things which allow them to work and grow next feature is living things reproduce reproduce means give birth to young ones living things produce young ones of their own kind for example hen lay eggs while cow gives birth to its calf last feature of living things is living things feel Living things can feel changes around them with the help of sense organs. Human beings have ears to hear, eyes to see, nose to breathe and smell, tongue to taste and skin to feel touch. Plants too can feel changes around them. For example, sunflower turn towards light. But non-living things do not show any such feature they cannot move from one place to another on their own they do not feel they don't grow now i hope that you have clearly understood living and non living things and how they are different from each other so please learn the chapter and do all exercises as you will be getting an assignment related to the chapter tomorrow have a nice day thank you